of time. What do you think? Is the time why the, valuable? Why the connection is bad? Mm. I don't know. Can you hear me now? Yeah, hear you. Yeah. Okay. Okay. The value of the time and importance of the time. Is the time valuable, you think? Yes, I think. And uh, I say the video, uh, yeah, the boys, uh, yeah, it's similar uh, to me, yeah, when I was young. Yeah, just uh, lazy. You are really young. <laughs> what? Yeah, no, it, it just, uh, I just, sorry, <laughs> I'm, he's smart, yeah, he's smart. I think he's not junior. He's, uh, I think, yeah, I think he is a boy. I think he's about um, eight to nine years old. I don't know. Yeah, very small. Uh, but uh, I don't know why they just give the, uh, I think, lessons. Yeah, give lessons. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, I think time is valuable, and um, of course, yeah. Oh, I think that your predict, uh, predict uh, true because, uh, yeah, I think today uh, time is very valuable. Yeah, in my mind, time very valuable, and yeah, you just uh, give me the video. Yeah, it's um similar to my mind. Well, I just told yeah. me. Mm. Uh, and, <laughs> yeah. Uh, um, yeah. but, uh, or, you know, yeah, it's just a story. Mm -hmm. Of and, course, uh, yeah. Of course, mm. we're going to talk about the stories, of course. For example, the purpose of, uh, you know, showing this video and sharing this video with you is to talk about the stories, of course. We're going to talk about different types of stories. So tell me, are you interested in this type of stories, like, you know, the video that we watched together? Mm. Yeah, I get. Yeah, I get it. I get uh, the lessons that uh, the video shows to us. But uh, yeah, as you know, I'm not interested in stories. <laughs> yeah, of course. I've, and uh, it's. Uh, I think. Oh, is this the fuck too? I'm not sure what it is. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. So, uh, oh. let me let me share something with you. So let me. Okay and share the screen <clears throat> so okay well now you can see the screen i'm gonna put this here okay of course we have different type of reading genres and we need to write stories or reading genres okay so and i'm going to ask you okay which one you are interested in so biography what do oh, you think bi biography Oh, there, the story there. of a real, you know, of a real person's life that has been written by another person. For example, oh. I wrote about your life. This is biography. What do you think? Have you ever read something like this biography? No, I'm, I'm not interested in this. It is, uh, <laughs> yeah, looking, I think I just considered it, yeah, very mm -hmm. weird because uh, I, I never write a live a person, yeah, it's like a parasite, yeah. Okay, mm -hmm. so biography, yeah, and if mm -hmm. I think um, these stories, stories, yeah, it's just uh, uh, only works, uh, only works on famous people, yeah, someone's uh, uh, maybe write about their life, yeah, famous uh, mm -hmm. people's life, I think, yeah, biography. Mm. Yeah. Okay, so okay, the second oh. one is realistic fiction. Of course, as you know, fiction is a kind of story that is not ba actually based on reality. It's something mm. like imaginary based on imagination of someone, okay? So, uh, and realistic fiction story using made up characters that takes place in modern times. That's a kind of fiction stories. Okay, what do you think? No, not at all, of course. Mm, realistic description. Oh, okay, yeah, I think <laughs> yeah. um, um, yeah, I I think I think in my books, yeah, I also create uh, some mad, uh, of course, man-made uh, characters. Yeah, I just uh, write them, draw them, but uh, not a story. I just uh, wrote about them. Yeah, just mm -hmm. for fun and uh, just um, mm -hmm. yeah, kill the time. Okay, realistic fiction. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah. You know, I'm, and I'm not real estate agent. I'm I not think uh, interested. This one, I think this one can be your choice, not fiction. So if you want to yeah. read the story, I think you'd rather not fiction. All information is based on true facts and not made up. Oh, I think it's non-fiction. Oh, let me think. Real uh, yeah. stories. Yeah, stories of uh, Liza. I like it. Facts and factual information. I think it's not bad, you know. Of course, mm. at least you have something, you know, factual. So it's not bad. Oh. Okay. We have a mystery. A mystery is, you know, full of secrets. You know, about a puzzling event that is not solved until the end of the story. Oh, I interested in it. Oh, yes. Yeah, like, uh, some, yeah, cases, uh, model cases. Yeah, I don't mean uh, it is a story. So, story, nest story, yeah, some mm, disappearing blend. Yeah. <laughs> is this a mystery? Mm -hmm. I think no. Of course. Uh, I like this. I like this genre. I like this. Oh, and hey. yeah, we have another one, science fiction, the story that blends uh, oh, science knowledge fiction. of scientific facts and fiction, of course. Uh, yeah, I, so, yeah, just so technology. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Yeah, I think, yeah, just a little bit interest in this, kind of, yeah, in this aspect of, yeah, stories, I think, uh, ah. science fiction. <laughs> Yeah, science fiction. Uh, yeah, story of a uh, autopilot. I don't know. Uh, uh, maybe of course some you know, it's about some futuristic technology related to the future, and yeah. of course scientific facts and fiction. Of course, they're not real, so I am not interested in. If you ask me, okay. Mm -hmm. Now we have autobiography. Okay, and there is a difference between autobiography and biography. Okay, so. Autobiography, the story of a real person's life that is written by that person. For example, I write about myself. So this is autobiography, okay? Oh, autobiography. Mm, I think, uh, mm, uh, eccentric. Yeah, a little bit eccentric. Uh, and um, autobiography, uh, I think, yeah, I want to write myself, okay? I write a story. I think I'm going to write stories. Um, yeah, in my life by myself. No. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, First, okay. And we have fantasy story <laughs> including elements that are impossible, such as talking animals or magical powers. <laughs> I love this <laughs> one. <laughs> oh, fantasy. fantasy. Yeah, what do you think? <laughs> fantasy. Uh, yeah, I, yeah. The first, uh, yeah, you just uh, first uh, talk. Uh, uh, yeah, reading the meaning of this. Uh, yeah, including elements. I just found this is um, yeah, like uh, about uh, yeah, chemi chemistry. But um, no, it's about animals, so magic power. So, okay, fantasy. Oh, mm -hmm. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not uh, interested in it, you not. know. <laughs> of okay. course you're not. Okay, we have folk tale. Tell me the story, of course, let me say about this word, okay. For, uh, folk tale, story often with a message that was initially passed on by word of mouth. For example, you know, it's something like traditional stories. You know, mm. something like an you know, oral traditional story that, you know, passed on, you know, person by person from, you know, old generation to the youngest, to, uh, to the youngest generation. So it's something like folktale. And maybe they're interesting, I think. Well, some of them are it's just, it's just your choice. I'm not, uh, yeah, I'm not uh, interested in uh, folktale. Yeah, just some stories mm -hmm. for children, young children, not for teenagers, you know. Uh, yes, like uh, a fast, a fast, and a, a fast, and a, yeah, a bunch of grapes, cocktail from mm -hmm. Mon yeah. uh, Fontaine. Yeah, from Fontaine. Okay, so next, Pelchi. Yeah, yeah uh, Pelchi. <laughs> your, your favorite. Okay. What? <laughs> what are you saying? No, I was joking. Okay, so 
Uh, I'm playing poetry, of course, you know, it's kind of literature, so you know this poem, poetry, and um, historical okay. fiction, of course, mm. again, you know, imaginary story with, or fictional story with real or invented characters that takes place during a historical time. Oh, we have a lot of historical fictions. Oh, uh, historical fiction, yeah, the time I, I was born, I think. Is a history of fiction. I don't know. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? Oh God. Yeah, <laughs> okay, yeah, I think it just uh, yeah, took place um, after took place for a long time. Taken place for a long time. I don't know. Uh, yeah, I was born. Um, it's still a history historical fiction. Okay. Of course, you know, um, each country has uh, may, maybe some uh, uh, historical characters that, of course, a lot of stories are written about their lives and, of course, about their journeys and something like this. These are historical fictions. Okay. Yeah. Of course, yeah, we have a lot of films about maybe this historical characters. So oh. they can be real or they can be invented by, I don't know, writers, imagination and minds or something like this. Well, yeah. so, okay, you'll learn about, you know, different type of ratings. And now let's get started on book. I'm going to close this. So we'll let me to close and open the dear book. Okay, so. Literature and fiction. There are some questions here. Okay, would you read the question? Then we are going to watch the video together. Fact, flex, okay. and then answer the question. So let's take a look at the questions. Okay, literature and fiction. What is fiction? Okay, how long do you think people have been reading fiction? Oh, uh, what kind of fictions? Uh, oh, fiction idea. Which do you think is the most popular literary genre? Okay. Genre? Why do people... Oh, genre? What's that word? Uh, why do people read this genre? Yeah, just kind. Uh, who do you think is the most popular fiction writer? Oh, Shakespeare. Okay, so first question. So... What is... Oh. Let me and the most popular fiction writer. So I underline the keywords. Now let's watch. Don't forget to have your pen or pencil to make notes. So let's oh. watch the video together and find the answers of questions. Okay. Okay, I will imitate you. Okay. Uh, <laughs> okay. Fiction. So let me. Okay, play the video. Just wait one minute and. There is okay. <clears throat> Widows, and then we have backlinks. Okay, unit nine. Just wait one moment. Hi everyone, I'm Amy and welcome to Factflix. Today we're looking at why people tell stories. Max, what are you doing? I'm trying to find a news story for you. Oh, okay. News stories are one kind of story, but today we're looking at fiction. You know, stories that people make up. Today's question is, why do we read fiction? Now, do you know how long we've been reading and writing fiction? Since the invention of the printing press, I suppose. No, much longer than that. The first work of fiction is 4,000 years old. 4,000? That's old? Yes. Nobody knows exactly who wrote it, but we know the author was from the area that is now Iraq. So, what kind of fiction is it? It's a long poem about a king who makes a journey. Poetry was the most popular genre in the past. Later folktales and plays became popular too. 
well, I prefer science fiction to any other genre. I'd much rather read science fiction than a folk tale or a play, for example. Science fiction is a modern literary genre. But do you know what the most popular genre is today? Fantasy. I guess that's quite similar to science fiction. It's a way to escape from your own world for a while. And it's a good way to pass time, especially when you're alone. I guess that's true of reading all kinds of fiction. True. So, Max, last question. Who do you think is the most popular fiction writer of all time? Mm, Isaac Asimov? No, it isn't a science fiction writer. It's an author famous for writing mysteries. Agatha Christie. Her novels have sold around two billion copies all over the world. That's a lot of books. To be honest, I like mysteries better than fantasy novels. They help you relax and have fun trying to solve the mystery. Which would you rather read? Hmm, I don't mind mysteries or fantasy novels, but I prefer something else. Really? Which genre do you like best? My favourite genre is classic literature. Why is that? You find out about places you've never been to and people you've never met. I love reading about the different characters, learning about how they behave and why. I think it's helped me to understand people in real life. Does that mean you understand me? <laughs> no, Max. I'll never understand you. Bye, everyone. Bye. <clears throat> OK. Now let me share the book again. So, what is fiction? Oh, you asked me. OK, it's a story. Uh, that there is that no else here. Mm -hmm. oh. Okay, so next. Oh, is that enough? Oh. Okay, fiction. Oh. Yeah. What's wrong? If you if you need, okay, if you need, you can watch it again. It's okay. So if you couldn't find the answer, so you can watch it again. Okay, so next. Uh, has uh how long do you think people have been reading fiction what okay uh, how long oh, I think <laughs> oh okay so let's see i asked wait. you to have your pen and pencil to mac newton okay well wait 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 right. wait wait let me first, oh, first i think mm, they they uh, yeah they just explained no they just show us that uh yeah, the girl just uh, told us, told me that. Uh, yeah, I think they uh, don't know, uh, don't know how long, but uh, according to her, I think, um, I think um, people have have been reading fiction. Yeah, uh, since no, for four thousand years old. Yeah, <laughs> that right? Yeah. 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 I yeah. Just um, firstly, I just felt that uh. Yeah, it just um, people have been written. Yeah, when it is, uh, I think were created us. Uh, when we have a printing machine, I know. Okay, so um, exactly is uh, for a thousand years old. Okay, next. Uh, what how kinds long do of... you think people have re have been reading fiction? Okay, so how long? Okay, so and what kind of fiction are there? Okay, what kinds of fiction are there? Yeah, let's talk about genres. Okay, genre. Oh, why? What did told that? Uh, fiction. Yeah, a lot. Oh, but um. <laughs> Don't a lot. Just this. Okay, so I have a suggestion for you. Okay, so let's watch it again. I think it's not bad to watch it again and try to find the answer. Pay attention. That is really important. As we talked about listening, listening is really important. So just you know, okay, if you're not interested, then you can not to watch. Okay, just listen. Okay. Try to figure out the actually main point and the answers. OK, ready again. Just I want to correct answers. OK. Yeah. Ready? Why not? 
Chris, yes. Okay, just let me <clears throat> share it again. So. Hi everyone, I'm Amy and welcome to Fact Flicks. Today we're looking at why people tell stories. Max, what are you doing? I'm trying to find a news story for you. Oh, okay. News stories are one kind of story, but today we're looking at fiction. You know, stories that people make up. Today's question is, why do we read fiction? Now, do you know how long we've been reading and writing fiction? Since the invention of the printing press, I suppose. No, much longer than that. The first work of fiction is 4,000 years old. 4,000? That's old. Yes. Nobody knows exactly who wrote it, but we know the author was from the area that is now Iraq. So, what kind of fiction is it? It's a long poem about a king who makes a journey. Poetry was the most popular genre in the past. Later folk tales and plays became popular too. Well, I prefer science fiction to any other genre. I'd much rather read science fiction than a folk tale or a play, for example. Science fiction is a modern literary genre. But do you know what the most popular genre is today? Fantasy. I guess that's quite similar to science fiction. It's a way to escape from your own world for a while. And it's a good way to pass time, especially when you're alone. I guess that's true of reading all kinds of fiction. True. So, Max, last question. Who do you think is the most popular fiction writer of all time? Mm, Isaac Asimov? No, it isn't a science fiction writer. It's an author famous for writing mysteries. Agatha Christie. Her novels have sold around two billion copies all over the world. That's a lot of books. To be honest, I like mysteries better than fantasy novels. They help you relax and have fun trying to solve the mystery. Which would you rather read? Hmm, I don't mind mysteries or fantasy novels, but I prefer something else. Really? Which genre do you like best? My favourite genre is classic literature. Why is that? You find out about places you've never been to and people you've never met. I love reading about the different characters and learning about how they behave and why. I think it's helped me to understand people in real life. Does that mean you understand me? <laughs> no, Max. I'll never understand you. Bye, everyone. Bye. Well, what the hell? OK. Mm. OK, let me share the screen again. <clears throat> Okay. What is fiction? Yeah, they tell. They just tell. Okay, but what is fiction? Yeah, fiction uh, stories that uh, people make. Excellent. Very good. That is made oh. up by people. Okay, I how just, long I, do you think? Yeah, I just, just told, I, just, I just told you before, I think you didn't listen. Yeah, stories that are made by by people. Yeah, yeah. yeah I see. Okay, and, uh, but you, you answered the second one. Of course, you said four thousand. About the third yeah. one, what, what kind of fictions? What kind of fictions are there? Hmm. Yeah. Uh, okay. So poem. Yeah, long poem. Oh wait, a poetry set. Mm. Poetry and. Poetry. Why? Why? Yeah. And okay. And poetry. I just uh. Oh, 
folk too. And fantasy, their fictions, yeah, science fiction, historical fictions, and their fictions. Well, I just follow <laughs> you. You chose the talk. <laughs> But they mentioned, they mentioned, you know, uh, folk tale, and of course they mentioned science fiction, poetry, so all of them. It's it's okay, you know, no matter. Okay. I the just next one. Heard. Oh, I think um, yeah. can I can I tell all? Yeah, tell all that that they uh list. They have list. Yeah. Okay. So uh -huh. yeah, poetry. Okay. Folk tale. You know. Folk of course, day. I know. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, it's a fantasy of oh yeah, of fiction. Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay. Most science popular? fiction. Oh, uh, popular. Uh, present in at the present. Uh, yeah, fantasy. In present time, yeah, of course, fantasy. And why do people read this genre? Well, why do people read this genre? Oh, I think uh, interesting. Why? Why I just hear fantasy? Fantasy, but um, why do people read this genre? <laughs> I think yeah, the the yeah the boy said that. I think it, oh, the boy said it is um interesting. No, more interesting. I think than a uh, mystery. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Is it? Or uh, is it? <laughs> so okay, <laughs> no, of course not. Okay, uh, who do you think is the most popular fiction? Writer. What? Okay, so yeah. Uh, Asimo. Wait, wait, wait. I, I got her shit. Yeah, of course. <laughs> yeah, of course. Okay, great. So the second was but better. Okay, excellent. I got a Christy and yeah, she wrote amazing stories. Oh, she died. Oh, yeah, uh, of course. Did you, oh, did you know? Fact that uh, yeah, she um, that I got her Christy, yeah. The most, uh, I think, famous author. I think she dies in a mystery way that uh, now people, yeah, have, um, uh, yeah, I think can solve uh, why she did. Yeah, I think. Oh wait, ah. is that is that right? Mm. Wait. Yeah, you have noticeable information. So would you share yes. information about? Yeah, her dad, me. Of course, good. I just yeah. read, yeah, yeah read a book. It, it, yeah, oh, huh. you read yeah. yeah, I got it. I think, yeah, it's a book about about historical fiction, yeah. Ah, okay, so, okay, now, let's go page to page 128 and learn some new words. So, let me... Oh, no. Why not? Oh, yes. Ah, of course, you know those words. Okay. So let's complete this part. <clears throat> we have some words in the box and we're going to complete the sentences using the words from the box. Okay. Okay. Oh, the classic. One. Yeah, classic. Okay. Uh, fantasy, fact, historical fiction, horror. I like this. Yeah, uh, okay. Uh, mystery, oh, mystery, play, oh, play, I don't think play is a mm -hmm. story, uh, science fiction, hmm, okay, first objective, uh, number one, uh, match the description one to eight with the correct generous, am I pronounce it right, um, what? am I pronounce, oh, pronouncing the, the word genre, right, genre, yeah, genre. genre, genre, say genre. genre. Yeah, genre. genre. Yeah, yeah. I just thought, yeah, I just thought it a, a name. Okay, number one, uh, a frightening story. Okay, horror story. Uh, this kind of story is often made into a movie. Yeah, horror, horror. Horror? Um, Do it. Uh, yeah. Okay, frightening. Of course, this is horror. Yeah, of course. They're really yeah. scary. I'm going to, no, they're not as scary. Of course, it's something else. It's not as scary. It's, it's a little disgusting. Okay, number two. Uh, story. story. Mm. Okay, it's performed by actors. Oh my God, I heard this. Uh, in front of an audience. Oh, play. Play. Yeah, right. Three. Uh, uh, we have no, we have no uh, story by a famous author. 
Yeah, me. Uh, this kind of book is often studied at school. Ah, uh, what's this? Um, fuck tail. <laughs> uh, no, of course not. You know, of course, a well-known story by a famous author. This kind of book is often studied. For example, uh, we have some classic stories. You know that are taught in school and you know so they're classic stories maybe classic hmm. some classic. poems uh, some poems of course you know when of course in literature subject of course you study and you read some poems some classic stories uh, so and classic and you learn about classic literature so i think classic number four okay Damn, I wrong. No. Okay, number four. A story about life in the past. Oh, in the future on other planets. Uh, it often it often includes that includes uh, astronauts and robots. Science fiction, of course. Of course. Fine. Oh, this this is usually about crime. You have to read the story carefully to find out who the criminal was. Oh, my story. Of course. And six. <clears throat> An old story belonging to a culture. It often teaches us. Culture. Um, oh, culture. Stupid. Why stupid? Oh, it often teaches a uh, uh, lesson, and parents uh, sometimes tell the story to their children uh yeah fuck too very good and seven oh this is a <laughs> historical fiction i'm wrong uh this kind of story um is invented but it is about real characters and even events are from the past oh history fiction definitely yes very good and eight eight oh is it uh, hey, a story about life in a different world. It often includes uh, strange animals and uh, magical events of fantasy. Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay. Well, okay, let's read the opening sentences of the stories one, two, four. And what genre do you think they are? So let's read and guess. Okay, you read. Oh no, uh, number one, the doors of a spaceship open smoothly and quietly uh, in front of us, uh, like Mars, uh, silent, unwelcoming, uh, and cooler than ice. What? What? Cooler than ice? Colder than no. ice, colder. It's, it's well, really cold. I just thought Mars, I just thought Mars is uh, hot. Why do they say ah, uh, really? cooler than ice? Yeah. Yeah. I, I don't have it. any information about Mars. So, uh, so, what's your oh, what's your uh, Okay, that is a bit. Uh, science fiction. Science fiction, very good. And uh, fetch my dragon. Oh, fetch. Okay, so it's synonym of bring. Yeah. Uh, set King Zach on. Name. Mm -hmm. What? Okay, just say. Okay, said King Zakon to his servant. Today we must uh, travel to the mountains. My brother is in danger. Last night he spoke to me in my dreams. This fantasy. Yeah, of course. Bring my dragon, really? Said King. <laughs> Why? <laughs> oh my God, how can I bring the dragon? Yeah. <laughs> okay, number three. Next one, Queen Elizabeth. Uh, Queen Elizabeth. Uh, what's worry? The year is twenty twenty. Oh, six. Uh, no. Uh, one thousand six hundred. Um, she said to herself, "We are uh, a weird century. Mm -hmm. A new century is starting, but I'm getting old. Who will take care of England when I die?" Uh, history of uh, fiction, yeah. Fiction? This is about number three. Is I'm sorry, you know, I couldn't hear about number three. You say fiction? No, historical fiction. No. Oh, 
this is about you know it's something like she said her so news. Okay, starting when I'm getting old. Who? Okay, of course. Okay, and four. Um, I all but one. my. Mm -hmm. Uh, I have all but my wallet to buy for the coffee. Uh, suddenly I noticed a piece of paper inside. Please kill me. Oh, please help. It said, uh, help. Had it got there? Uh, who had written it? And why? Oh, I think my three. Yeah, of course, of course. Well, and we have some descriptive adverbs, of course, and uh, we are going to complete the sentences using these adverbs. So first of all, let's learn the meaning of these adverbs. And so, OK, bravely, uh, you know this, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, of course, and calmly, you know? I know already. Of course, okay. carefully. Carefully, yes. Okay, and this one. Okay, you know, hastily. Hastily. Yeah, I learned it. Uh, I, why they don't use quickly? Instead huh? of quickly. Hastily, yeah, yeah. Of course, very good. Of course, very good. And uh, quickly. Hesitant. Oh, Hesitant. Hesit hesitantly. Yet I know this through the word has this has this that uh, has it that I think. Oh, uncertainly, uncertainly. Yeah. Oh, uncertainly. Yeah. Yes, yes. Certainly, yes, yeah, yeah, of course. And yes, knowingly. Knowingly. Why they don't say uh, in what's that? I'm stupid. Uh, intently. No, I don't think. Yeah, purposely, uh, that, yeah. Of course, excellent, very good, purposely. Oh. Okay, and the next one? Oh, knowingly. Oh, I think it is, oh, it is uh, deliberately. Yeah, I think. Of course, you uh, said, you said correctly. You said correctly, purposely means knowingly, of course. And yeah. suspiciously, you oh. know. Yeah, doubly, I think. Oh, uh, of course. And uh, wearily. Yeah, oh, we wearily. Why do you say tie? Oh, and this is a, a, a verb. Yeah, 